What's poppin' everybody? It is late Saturday afternoon. We just got done watching Crown Jewel. Um, meh on the pay-per-view, but the uh, Logan Paul-Roman uh, Reigns match was actually the best match in my opinion. So uh, that was fun. And we also got to see our good buddy uh, Captain Powerlift, who I haven't seen in a hot minute. But uh, as you know, the show must go on and we must get back, get to hunting, because that's what we do best. And we're here right now outside of my favorite spot, good old Bits and Buttons. And we're going to go inside and see what they got. All right, guys, we're inside right now. Here's all the G.I. Joe stuff like you normally see. Looks like we got some bats and some alley vipers. And there's uh, one of the twins, the Croc Master. A bunch of their graded stuff. Here's all their Star Wars stuff. It looks like they got some new pieces in. They got some of the Unleashed figures, which are pretty cool. Here's some more Black Series. They got anything new in. There's Omega. Bo-Katan, Commander Bly. Oh, they got a Cara Dune credit in there. Um, let's see. There's a Rancor, speeder bike, the helmet. And then there's all the, uh, the three and three quarter stuff over here. Here's some of the vintage, but why I'm really here is what's over here. And uh, let's see, here's Toy Biz Legends, but that's why I'm here is because he's got the Iron Spider, which I want, and he's got the Future Foundation Spider-Man, which I want. Um, oh, he's got a Compound Hulk. He's got the Spider-Man and the Spinneret, which I already have. Um, I've got the Peter Parker and the Ned. Um... He's got this, which is really cool, too, which is these uh, Peter B. Parker, which I might get this because I haven't had one of these figures before, and I'm always down to check out new brands and stuff that I never had before, so I might grab one of those. Um, here's all the wrestling stuff. Hey, it's Daddy Ass. It's Billy Gunn. It's Daddy Ass. Uh, Beth Phoenix. Uh, some of the retros, it's Roman Reigns, got Mustafa Ali, some AEWs, Shayna Baszler, got Daniel Bryan, um, here's some, uh, loose elites and basics, some of the Hasbros, uh, let's do some Mego figures, we got some Builder figures going on in here. I think, oh, this is the newer one that came out. There's the Keaton Batman. Got Stiltman's back there. Got the statues, which look really dope. Here's some pops, some more statues. There's the Batman we always see. Here's all the DC stuff we got going on, all the McFarlane stuff. There's the... Uh, King Shark down there. Uh, let's see. Oh, we got a Chase Robin and a Chase Superman, which is pretty cool. I don't think I've ever seen this one. Oh, we got a unmasked uh, Zuren Ra. That's cool. What else we got? Oh, we got a, a Chase Hush. That's kind of cool. So, there's more gold label stuff. Um, there's more DC, so, oh, there you go, look at this bad boy, oh, the tumbler, look at that, I want that so bad, oh, I want that, but I don't know, damn it, that thing is sick, oh, that thing is sick, and I haven't done, you know, in reality, I haven't done a Lego speed build video in a hot minute, that might be cool to do, but, 2049 pieces huh I don't know I gotta think about that um, all right let me uh, let me continue to take a look around and uh, let me see what else I can find right, guys here's the Motu stuff uh, here's some Power Rangers hey look who's here it's the fine owner the fine proprietor of this establishment doing his thing Strutting his strutting his bit stuff. I don't know. I'm trying to think of a pose. Are you I can do. are you feel are you feeling bitsy today? I'm feeling very bitsy. <laughs> very very bitsy. Yeah. Oh, see. Yeah. What what are you doing? 
biscuits, biscuits in the supper time. time. See, see, you, you no, got. I'm starting a new trend. It's the bits. It's the bitsy biscuits the, trend. The bitsy biscuits dance. Yeah, the bitsy biscuits dance. Say that three times fast. I know I can't. <laughs> Somebody's gonna have to hack my mind to do it. Oh. <laughs> no pun intended. Yeah, no pun intended. But, uh, let's see. Here's all your I'm transformers. Not feeling, I'm just not feeling it today, man. Yeah, you're not bitsy enough today. I'm not feeling very bitsy. No, today. I'm sorry you're not feeling bitsy. It's okay. I like it though. Yeah. Just another day in the life of a toy store owner. That's it. That's all you can do. That's all I can do. Just <laughs> play with my toys. That's it. Just sit here, play with myself and my toys. Uh, transformers with the Super Sevens. We got Cherry. Was that is Sherry? Or is, or no, it's Terry. There you go, Alvin. Uh, let's see, oh, it's okay. It's okay. Here's more Transformers stuff. There's the three zero Blitzwing. Uh, here's a bunch of Turtle stuff. We got slashes. Um, we got some Leonardo's, Bride of Frankenstein. So. All right, it's getting late, and I've got a bunch of other stuff to do. So, oh, here's a whole bunch of McFarlane stuff, too. So, uh, oh, wow, look at that Jabba Chamberlain he's got back there. He's got Mark Teixeira, A-Rod. You got him? Hold on. So, <laughs> so, all right. Um, all right. What? Bacon and eggs. Ba who's is that? Who is that? Derpy Bacon. Who? Derpy Bacon. Derpy? Who's Derpy Bacon? From FGTV. I don't know who that is, but okay. Oh. Did you give that to him? Oh, thank you. See? Bits and Buttons taking care of their customers. So, all right. I'm, I'm going <laughs> to put the bacon on the biscuit. All right. Um, I'm going to go grab those Spider-Mans. I'm going to wrap it up in here, and then we'll see you back on the road momentarily. All right, guys. So now we're done with bits and buttons. I picked up some real cool stuff, which I'll give you a better look at when I get home. But now I'm here at a place that I haven't been to in a hot minute. We're here right now outside of Tate's. And it's been a minute since I've been there. So uh, we're going to go inside now and... Uh, See if they got anything new, anything interesting, anything that uh, piques my interest. Isn't that right, little poppin'? Yes. Okay, so let's go inside. Okay, as we're here in the Star Wars section right now, here's some three and three quarters, some 40th anniversary ones, got some loose figs over here. Here's the uh, Millennium Falcon from Kenner. Got some droid action going on, Job of the Hut. Uh, let's see, we got some more three and three quarter figures in here. We've got a lightsaber down there. Got some black series. Got Han and the Tauntaun. Got some fig pins. Uh, let's see. Here's a Princess Leia figure in the uh, mat. It's kind of cool looking. And Infinity Star. Oh, that's the white Darth Vader. Uh, here's a three pack, some more three and three quarters. Got some dark troopers and Moff Gideon up there. Uh, here's some statues and some busts, which are pretty cool. That Mando one right there with the uh, spear is pretty cool. Got an Ahsoka helmet. Got Gogu sitting on the Rock of Destiny. Got Obi Wan, Bo Katan, a Hunter. And some cool busts. Luke, some plates, some other miscellaneous stuff. There's some hot toys I think over here. They got the speeder bike, the scout trooper, what is that, Return of the Jedi, and uh, Mando. Uh, let's see, we got Boba Fett, we got Echo, they got Django. Here's a two pack. They got e Echo in here, there's Moff, Ahsoka, Mando's in there. Got Boba Fett on the throne. Got Gogu. The Dark Trooper. So, yeah, I got some pretty cool stuff. So, alright. Uh, let's continue looking around. Here's a wall of McFarlane DC stuff. So, we got Flashes, Lobos, Supermans, Aquamans, Batmans. Got Black Adam. Uh, we got Green Lantern two packs. We got 
Red Hood, the Riddler, the Bat Cycle, got Clayface and Joker. Let's see what's over here. Here's some of these DC Direct figures. Uh, nothing uh, interesting. Here's some loose figures. Here's some more uh, DC stuff over here. We got some models. Uh, let's see. Got the. Uh, what is this? Uh, Dark Knight Returns, Mayfix, it's an amazing Yamaguchi Joker, there's a Fig Arts and a Mayfix Wonder Woman, um, here's some uh, Marvel stuff in the glass case, nothing interesting, uh, here's some Marvel stuff, we've got Iron Man Illusion, we've got Zombie Hunter Spider-Man, the Mark V Rescue, Here's the uh, Japanese Spider-Man. I might grab that. Uh, here's a another like random like miscellaneous case. Uh, let's see. There's some more Marvel stuff. They got the uh, Fig Arts Falcon and Winter Soldiers, Doctor Strange, Gamora. We got Thor. Um. Anything else interesting? Got the Miles Morales. Um, all right, let's uh, let's keep looking around. Oh, actually, here here's some turtle stuff. We got Slash, the Fugitoid, Ultram. They got the Playmates, Last Ronin figure. Here's the Last Ronin figure I did the review on the other day. There's some other turtle stuff. There's the uh, Darkwing Duck. It's pretty cool. Um, here's some wrestling stuff. We got IRS, Earthquake, Typhoon, Godfather, British Bulldog, Warrior, Stone Cold, got Kelly Kelly, Edge, Nasty Boys. Um, here's some G.I. Joe action going on over here. Some more G.I. Joes. Got a Lone Ranger. We got the Ecto-1. Got some Motu stuff. There's the uh, Centurions. It's East McCloud. Jake Rockwell. Max Ray. Used to love that show as a cartoon. Well, used to love that show when I had an eye as a cartoon. Obviously, I loved it as a kid. Um, here's some more Transformers. I uh, don't see anything. Oh, they got the cops figures that's cool I haven't seen those in a while forever here's some original Thundercats uh, some more Transformers stuff all right uh, let's make our way over to the hot toys and see if they got anything new over there a whole bunch of graded comics they got uh, Robocop number one got an Undertaker uh, let's see got War Machine there's the uh, J. Scott Campbell piece that they did. Got some fossil watches. Uh, let's see. Got a Mortal Hulk in there. Here's some Diamond Select and some Hulk figures. Here's some like little mini busts. Some statues. That's cool. That Diamond Select Wolverine back there is so freaking sick. There's a bunch of DC stuff going on. Looks like they got some statues going on. They got Gambit up there, which is dope. They got Galactus, Scarlet Witch. Uh, here's some of the DC stuff. Oh, that's cool. That Nightfall Mayfix. Damn, that thing is sick. Uh, that thing is cool. Let's see, here's some more statues and other miscellaneous stuff going on. Uh, and then here's the uh, the hot toy. So they have Black Widow, which is new. They got this cable, which looks absolutely ridiculous. That gun is so cool. They did a good job on that. They got Taskmaster, uh, Bucky from uh, Falcon and Winter Soldier. Here's the re-release of that Iron Man. 
We got the Captain Carter from What If, which looks really good. We got this Venomized Iron Man, which is meh. Uh, let's see, there's the What If Zombie Hunter, Spider-Man. We got War Machine. Captain Marvel, here's the uh, Justice League 2 pack with the uh, black suit Superman and the Nightmare Batman. The Nightmare Batman looks great. The Superman is just, it's meh. But yeah, I like that Nightmare Batman. That thing's kind of cool. So, and they got uh, Vision down there. They got some other miscellaneous stuff. So, and Jakey's look, Little Poppin's looking at the huh, the wrestling figures. The wrestlers of fame. The other wrestlers of fame? Okay. They got these Legends of Lucha Libre figures by Boss Fight, which are new, which I haven't seen before. Here's Tyree Valkyrie. They got Penta, um, Juventud, and they got uh, Ray Phoenix, which is kind of cool. These actually look pretty good. They actually look like they got some decent articulation to them. Um, let's see what else we got. Oh, they got the Venom statue up there. There's more Hot Toys. And they got some stuff over here. More DC figures. There's Hawkman, Black Adam. Uh, there's some Star Trek. Some more Star Wars. Oh, there's Splinter. Is uh, Van Helsing. We saw that in New York Comic Con. Oh, here's the uh, Ultimate ET. That's kind of cool. But I'll grab that from Bits when when they get it. Uh, they got RoboCop. Uh, there's the Japanese Spider-Man. Oh, they got the Namor down there, Black Panther wave. What's this Spider-Man? Oh, it's a Japanese Spider-Man. And they got the Moon Knight, Fire Lord. And they got the Ralph McQuarrie Vader, it looks like. So they got some pretty cool stuff. I mean, again, it's been a hot minute since I've been here. So I'll probably wind up grabbing that Japanese Spider-Man. But let me take one more pass through. And then, uh, yeah, I'll see you at the next place. Guys, we are here right now outside of uh walmart so of course no hunt video would be complete without stopping at a walmart and target so obviously if we're at a walmart now target's gonna be our last stop because it's getting late and uh i gotta get back home because well i've got things to do and you know he's gotta relax for a little bit so uh yeah we're gonna go on to walmart right now and if you guys are not familiar with this walmart this is the walmart with Kevin Nash figure still sitting there. Oh. This is like my favorite Walmart. You see the Kevin Nash? Yeah, I see it. See, you're all excited? Yeah. <laughs> How did they get up there? I don't know. So, all right, let's go inside and see what they got. As we're down the figure out right now, here's some Jurassic World stuff over here. Uh, here's some G.I. Joe, some Buzz Lightyear. We got Croc Masters. Uh, here's some Marvel stuff, but I don't see any legends here's some dc stuff uh here's some star wars here's some of the uh, star wars ships oh okay well hold on uh here's some minecraft some beyblades oh ja jakey found the cm punk walmart they have two of them yeah and he's just dropping stuff all over the place. Uh, let's see, we got uh, Trent, Jake Hager, got the Hangmans, there's Chuck, another Jake Hager, Cody, Anna, Britt, John Silver, Eno Uno, we got the uh, Million Dollar Man, Ultimate Warrior, Taker, Flair, we got Edge, Bretts, uh, let's see. The regular Brett, there's the British Bulldog, uh, there's Piggy, and yeah, Million Dollar Man. So, all right, well, I might grab another one of these just for the sake. Just be oh no, these boxes are all beat to shit. Yeah, never mind. Never mind. I want mine to be mint because I want to leave them on card. So. All right, let's go see what's over in the good old... Funko section. See, he knows. All right, let's go. All right, guys, we're down the neck of Funko section right now, and there looks like to be absolutely nothing of value in this aisle. 
obviously the Pops, the Funko Gold, the Clown, um, King Kong, Bob Ross, Halloween, and some light brights, and that's about it. So that's full of crap. It's full of crap. That's right. So Funko sucks. Funko does suck. You're right. So uh, all right, let's hit the road. Let's go to Target, which will be our last stop, and we'll see you back here momentarily. All right, guys, as you can see, it's gotten dark out, and we're here at our final stop of the evening. We're here right now outside of a Super Target, so let's go inside and see what they got. Guys, we're down to figure out right now. We got Bray, got Jeff, we got the uh, Luminaries Jericho, got uh, more basic Brays, Farouk, we got Christian, Thunder Rosa, a bunch of Nyla Roses, we got some Jawas, some Landos. Um, some uh, Fifth Brother, some of the Obi-Wan series, we got Hordak, She-Ra, we got the 40th uh, He-Man, we got some of the Avatar stuff, um, there's some Jurassic Park stuff, uh, they got an end cap over here with some stuff, here's some more of the wrestling figures, Rey Mysterio, there's the Batman, and it's Wally, alright, come on. Uh, let's see what we got down here. <clears throat> Come on, Jake. We got uh, some Transformers. We got Power Rangers. Here's some of the McFarlane figures. We got the Ocean Master, Atom Smasher, uh, Deathstroke, Wonder Woman, Superwoman. Uh, let's see what else we got. We got Iron Man, Speedball. Marvel uh, US agent there's Ned and Peter um, I think that is about it which is kind of disappointing so uh, yeah where are we going okay you heard him that's where we're headed right, guys we're here at the NECA Funko section right now here's some pops um, we got the Michelangelo and Chung Lee we got the this cool little Wolverine thing going on over here. Uh, we got the Batman Villains layer. We got Sam and Twitch. We got some Sword and Shield Pokemon stuff. Uh, we got Joker, Mr. Freeze, some Corrupted Venom pins, some Stranger Things, some more Pops, Godzilla down there. Uh, let's see. Here's uh, Zack and Smash Turtles. We got Thylong. Here's the... Uh, Pinball, Stern Turtles, got a bunch of horror stuff, got the uh, Ultimate Doc Brown, uh, let's see, I think that is about it for stuff, so um, yeah, that's, 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 uh, that's about it, so, um, You're forgetting about wh what am I forgetting about, I'm not forgetting about any, what, what, who's, hold on a second, who is that? nice okay all right we're gonna wrap it up um i'll show you everything that i got later when i get back home i also made an unexpected sh stop at walmart yesterday but i didn't have my camera on me and i picked up two figures there that i'll show you when we get back home and uh yeah we'll go from there all right guys and we're back home so let's go over what we picked up while we were out so obviously we stopped off at good old bits and buttons and we wound up grabbing a few um spider-mans so one we wound up grabbing the iron spider so definitely cool looking figure definitely interested in on doing a review on that one and we also picked up the future foundation spider-man now the reason why i waited to pick these up from bits rather than target or walmart not because they didn't have them on the shelves but because bits has them cheaper so why am I going to spend the money, you know, Target when I can get them at Bits? And then also we picked up this Peter B. Parker um, action figure. I think this is made by Sentinel, if I'm not mistaken. So we've got this pretty cool Peter B. Parker figure, which I'm definitely going to be doing a, a review on because this thing comes with a slew of accessories. So... This is pretty cool, so thank you to Dom, as always. I appreciate it. Um, then we went to 
uh, Tate's, where at Tate's we actually picked up the Japanese Spider-Man, because I thought that was pretty cool, and I thought that would be an interesting one to get as well to do a review on. So you got all these, uh, you know, anniversary Spider-Mans coming out, so I wanted to grab this Japanese one. Besides, with the Spider-Man figures, the articulation, I come to find out that they're really good on the Spider-Man figures, and there's nothing more fun than posing Spider-Man figures, because of all the, obviously, the poses you could put them in. So definitely going to do a review on all these that we got right here. Um, then we went to Walmart, we went to Target, nothing there. Um, I did go to a Walmart um, Friday afternoon and I did pick something up. I wound up grabbing um, Elite Series 96 um, Brock Lesnar. And this is Ponytail Brock. So definitely awesome to finally have a Ponytail Brock. And then of course, cannot not go and pick up a Hulk Hogan figure. So we got Hulk Hogan. So this thing's pretty cool. And they got the nice uh, hot dog tan going on here with Hogan. So pretty decent. So uh, maybe eventually I'll get a chance to do a review on these. And then also I came home and I had a box waiting for me at the door. So we wound up getting a pre-order in. Again, I rarely ever pre-order anything. Totally forgot about this because it was so long ago from Big Bad Toy Store. And here's the box right here, and I opened it, obviously. We wound up getting a Mythic Legion. So we wound up getting the Deluxe Gladiator Legion Builder. Now, all joking aside, this figure looks freaking badass. I love the more human, realistic ones like we've spoke about in the past. So this is definitely one I want to get out of the box and do a quick uh, review on. So maybe we'll do that within a couple of days, and we'll see that. But we got this Deluxe Gladiator legion builder so pretty sweet and uh yeah guys as you can see that wraps up the haul for this week all right guys and that wraps up another hunt video for this week so i hope you guys enjoyed um it was a little short this week only because i didn't have a lot of time the thing was out of town and i had a grocery shop do laundry do all the do all the i had to do the honey do list as it's like to call so you know because when i go away i like things to come back you know to where i don't have to do anything and of course you know what's good for the goose is good for the gander so i have to reciprocate in that in that way so other than that guys hopefully we'll be back on track next week um hopefully we'll be hanging out with the gang gang will be back in town um i know mike was at mike and jeff were at a toy show in tampa this past weekend so i hope he had a good turnout there and uh i don't know where dave was this weekend so yeah who knows so all right guys if you like what you saw please be sure to give a thumbs up if you're new please be sure to subscribe as always be sure to hit that bell so you get notified every time another toy hunting video gets uploaded for your viewing pleasure as always you can check out all the excellent content we always offer right here at mce and until next time guys that's what's popping